Hi everybody. Monday, February 14th. Happy Valentine's Day. I'm standing in our new training room here in El Dorado Hills and we'll be using this for our weekly office and trainings. We'll also be able to use this for first-time homebuyer seminars, investor or short sale seminars, and also consider contacting your database and allowing them to use the room for a community meeting. It might be a, a great idea. We've talked a lot about blogging over the last couple of weeks and you're receiving mine on a weekly basis. Other agents in the office are using it and now the company is using it to keep in touch with you. Hopefully you've already checked it out. It's goldnewsnetwork.tv. That's the web address. Check it out. I think you'll like it. For those of you not using Facebook yet, consider these stats. There are 500 million users. The average user has 130 friends. 57% are over 35 years old. 300 million log on every single day. And one third of Americans log on every day. They average about 55 minutes per day. I still believe that this can be an effective way of staying in touch with your contact base. I have a couple of friends that I'd like to introduce you to and they've got a new idea for short sale negotiations. Hi everybody, welcome to Fidelity National Title, Title Talk. I'm Scott Nordell with Fidelity National Title and I'm Pete Dawson with Fidelity National Title. Today, we have a value-added service for you. We're going to be discussing Fidelity's short sale processing. Basically, it's a streamline to start to, for your short sale processing transactions. Yes, yeah, Scott, it's really a big deal. Um, this is a value-added service that Fidelity National provides. The fee for this short sale processing is $475, and that's shown on the seller's HUD. The listing agent is not going to pay for that service. The best thing about it is you're working with a local operation, a local department, and your local escrow officer here with this process. That's a big deal. Huge. If you guys want more information about this great product, please contact Scott Nordell or myself, Pete Dawson. Let's do this. Hey, Scott, this is Title Talk. <laughs> hey, everybody. Just wanted to follow up after last week's discussion with Katie DeGunther regarding Proposition 90. Remember that right here in El Dorado Hills, we're fortunate to have two communities that um, specialize in over 55 active adult communities, and those are both Versante and Four Seasons. Also, check out a new marketing idea that Mark Crochet is using effectively. Have a great week, and I'll see you next time.